I don't know what it is I am disassociating with this season. For some reason, I am all here for Christmas and decorating and I don't know why. Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Anything like me and you got some childhood trauma that you like don't know how to deal with revolving the holidays um you are probably you've probably had issues with christmas i've never in my life loved christmas but for some reason this year i am just for it like i just want everything to be as christmassy as shit and i don't know why but i'm gonna roll with it because normally i get really depressed around this time and for the first time in like 17 years i'm not i decided to go Christmas thrift shopping. I wanted to thrift for any and all Christmas decorations, whether they were kitschy, sparkly, glittery, whatever. I've already got my Christmas tree up, as you can see. Like, fall la la la, get turned up in this bitch. Uh, so, I don't know really what's going on with Brooke. I think it might have something to do with YouTube. YouTube has a lot of like videos and vloggers and just people who make a lot of cool seasonal videos like winter routines and summer routines and you know Christmas decorating just like stuff that really makes you excited about the holidays and makes you interested in how other people transition into the season so if this is because of youtube like i'm so here for it i'm so happy about it like honestly yeah whatever i'm gonna stop talking and we're gonna get into this haul i'm gonna show you what i do blah, 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 show you what i do what i do with all the stuff that i thrifted for christmas so don't forget if you do enjoy this video to give it a thumbs up down below and subscribe as well and also follow me on uh instagram because i use that a lot and i would love to talk to you guys so yeah but first let me insert um some car clips okay okay not to thrift shop for anything else except for Christmas decorations. Also, I just saw a big lots and I kind of want to go in there because they got crazy deals on Christmas stuff, so. Back in the car, I was not expecting this Goodwill to have so much stuff, but it had so much stuff. And I also, I did do some shopping for um, a sweater haul, so y'all stay tuned for that. But um, I also made friends with the cashier because he is in here. He's in that. He's in this Goodwill almost every time I come, and I told him that, and he was like, "Oh well, I only work two days a week." I'm like, "Well, I." come in here probably two or three days a week and I always see you. He's like, yeah, you look familiar. And I'm just like, yeah. We introduce ourselves to each other and now I have a good wolf friend. That's always a plus. But anywho, it is raining again and I'm going to go home and show you guys all the cute little Christmas things I bought. The first Christmas item that I thrifted. This really cute hand-woven red and green basket with little Christmas trees on it. Like this is just so pure. I don't know what the hell I'm gonna do with this, but like, this is Christmas AF. Like, I'm so here for this. And cute, like, you can put Christmas decor, like, balls in here and just like sit it somewhere. Like, it is so cute. I'm just, I love this little box. Bo I mean, bleh, bleh, bleh. just like, I'm just gonna pack a little Christmas picnic and I'm gonna go sit in the snow. There's no snow here yet. There's no snow here. I'm gonna go sit in the snow somewhere with my little Christmas basket full of Christmas cookies and eat them by my damn self. The next thing that I thrifted were these little, or big, Christmas bows. Um, it came in a pack of three, and my grandma always had these when I lived with her. Christmas bows just like tied to doors. So I just think it's so vibrant, it's really pretty, and I've got three. Um, I don't know where I'll put them yet, but you know, we're, we're gonna, I mean, I'm gonna have a montage in here, I'm sure. I always have those, um, showing you how I decorate. The next Christmas item that I thrifted is this cute, this is so cute. It's just these little Santas around Christmas trees. And it's like this thick 
wooden piece that someone handmade and hand painted. It is so cool. I love handmade Christmas items. And I know that people are like, oh, that's country. That's like it. It's what I grew up around. It's what all of my best friend's parents did with their Christmas trees and stuff. And I just think it's freaking cool. So this little guy is going to sit. Everybody can see him. Or these little men. These little Santas. These little tri Santa, this trifecta, this Santa, so y'all get it. You get it. This, I don't know what this thing is. It's definitely handmade, but like, I don't know what he is. It's like a flying Santa, y'all. He's literally flying. Like this man is just flying off somewhere. Where is he going? We don't know. I don't know what he's doing. He's minding his damn business is what he's Simple, doing. Simple, like it's not kitschy, I don't think. It's, I mean, it's obviously handmade, hand painted. He's cute, I don't care, he's cute. I love that old fat man, okay? I've never met a single person who buys stuff like this and actually lights it for Christmas. A massive snowman candle, the texture on it is so cool. No, kind of like, like chunky snow. My grandma always had stuff like this and she never lit it. And when I was older, when I was younger, I was like, why the hell won't you like that, grandma? Like, but if you lit this, this would be a weird, horrifying mess. His face would melt. It would just be a shit show. I'm going to keep him. I like him. I'm aiming him. Patrick. I don't know. He's cool. Um, a little tea light goes in this and then this goes on top. This is also, it looks like it was hand painted, but a little tea light goes in it and it's just like a little snowman lamp. And he's holding a box of like, or it's a, it's a girl, excuse me. Miss Snow Woman is holding a box or a bag of flowers and she's got a little Christmas tree behind her. And this has like a little scene on it. It's so cute. And this says, give gifts from the heart. This is country bumpkin to me, okay? This is the stuff that when I was younger, I would see it and be like, who the heck would put that in their house? And now I'm just like, give me that tacky Christmas shit, yes! I saw this and within two seconds it was in my cart. It's just a fat little Santa. He is holding a wreath and he's holding a little light and he's trying to find his way to your chimney and he's got a little bear, bunny, something at his feet. He's mad cute. Like look at him stunting on all these hoes. Yes, Santa. And then he's standing on trees or like he's got a tree up his ass. I don't know. It's kishy, okay? This is kitschy and I'm gonna keep him and I don't care. If anyone can diagnose me or tell me why I like Christmas this year, go ahead and do it. Feel free in the comments, roast me. This is not Christmas related whatsoever, but I found this dope ass Salem, Massachusetts coffee mug. And it's got the Salem Witch Museum, the Custom House, and the House of Seven Gables on the back. And the front of it has the founder of the, the town of Salem, Roger Conan, and Witch House on it. Like. If this isn't the most on-brand thing I have ever bought in my entire life. All right, we also found this precious little glass box. No idea what's gonna go in her, but it's just a little gift bag. It's a glass gift bag and she's got some poinsettias on her. She's chipped in one spot, but I mean, that's fine. I can always turn that around and this is the front. Stuff like this just reminds me of home. It reminds me of being a kid at Christmas and like all the stuff that would be set up. And it, it's just time that I like, start my own Christmas decoration collection. Okay, I'm 23, let's get with so, it. I told Steven that this year, I really just wanted for us to have stockings. We do have a fireplace over in that corner. You can't really see it in the frame. Y'all, I found this gorgeous bee, this emerald green bee stocking, bee for Brooke, and yo, this thing is so pretty. What the hell? I'm hanging this up, like that's gorgeous. But then I'm looking around and I'm like, oh, I wish there was a matching S or something. I found an S. <laughs> this is so tiny. Steven's gonna see this beside this and be like, are you kidding me? You're so rude. S for Steven, B for Brooke. I run this shit. I wore the pants. I did the Christmas shopping. Regardless of the fact that they're way different sizes, I don't really care. I think they're cute and it's fine. Found a little Christmas candle and it's glittery and it's like textured. It looks more shiny, but whatever. It's just a little Christmas candle. 
It has really no scent, but it's pretty and shiny and I love it. So there is that. That's all I've got for you guys. I hope that you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a like and subscribe down below if you haven't already for more Christmas videos. I've got some um, great things in the making. There's a sweater haul coming up after this video, so stay tuned for that. If you don't normally have good holidays, Christmas, Thanksgiving, I hope that this year is different for you because it's different for me and it feels really, really strange and really good. But I will see you guys in the next one. Have a great rest of your week.